Welcome to our presentation on office ergonomics. The symptoms that poor ergonomic practices cause can be small and non-distinct and mostly go unnoticed. However, this may become more prominent over time. Therefore, it's important to maintain good posture and protect your body from injury. Ergonomic risk factors differ, depending on the type of work. Due to the placement of the mouse, keyboard or chair, an office-based employee may feel pain in their fingers, wrists, and arms. All workstations should be designed to allow employees to work in an upright position. All work surfaces should be adjustable to suit a range of employees and the tasks they may perform. For example, adjustable chairs to assist with good posture and support the spine. So, what is a good workstation setup? Start by choosing a chair that supports your spinal curve. Adjust the height of the chair so that your feet rest flat on the floor or on a footrest. Ensure that your thighs are parallel to the floor. Ensure that there is sufficient space for your knees, thighs, and feet under your desk. Where the desk is too high and cannot be adjusted, you must raise your chair to a workable height. Keep your shoulders relaxed and flexed at 90 degrees or less to your desk. Make sure that your monitor is directly in front of you, ideally at an arm's length and directly behind your keyboard. The top of the screen should be ideally at or below your eye level. Place your mouse and keyboard on the same surface and make sure they are in easy reach. Keep your wrists straight, with your upper arms close to your body. Your hands at or slightly below the level of your elbows. Even if you're in the most optimal position, whether it's sitting or standing, it's really important to move around during the day. So, ensure you take standing, stretching or walking breaks throughout the day. In summary, a good ergonomic position is really important and to move around throughout the day.